Hey there, it's Galen, design team member for Unity Stamp Company. Today I'm showing a set of holiday tags and a way to do easy tag lay layering um, with stamping and pattern paper. The first thing I like to do is use a big piece of paper and stamp out the sentiments that I want to use on my tags. Leave enough room to, for your die cut or punches so that you have um, enough room to, to pump punch them out or die cut them. I added extra sprigs and a heart um, to some of the sentiments. The kit comes with other um, cute little icons that you can add. I, For the background layers, I like to use pattern paper and Unity has a set called Holiday Intrigue paper pack and it's filled with holiday colors and I chose some of those um, in red and green and blue. Now, also I'm using the stamp kit called Winter Regards for those cute sentiments that you see. You can pair them on a card with an image, a stamped image, um, or just leave them sentiments for the tag. I have hemp cording. It's a hemp cord thread by, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, Galaces, G-A-L-A-C-E-S but you can find hemp cord anywhere online and in stores. I'm using a set of dies called Chunky Stitched Tag Dies by My Creative Time, and those are sort of layering dies. Here's my excess paper that I cut out the tags with. I'll reuse some of that for another time. So I die cut tags in layers. So the background is with pattern paper, and the top nested shape is um, a die cut of the sentiment. I use a crop -a dial to punch a hole in the pattern paper section, uh, but you can use a standard hole punch as well. I use foam tape and, of course, the hemp twine pre-cut. Everything is pre-cut. Um, if you do them all, all of your tags at once, you can just sort of do it assembly line style here and to get it done quicker. Instead of hole punching both layers, I just hole punch the back side, which is the pattern paper side, and add the twine to that. Um, I just, you can tie it however you like. T twine or ribbon work works for this technique. Um, it's very, very simple. Now, to make the top layer, which is the sentiment layer, pop up a little, I add foam tape. And that will cover a little bit of that hole, which it's fine because the tag is can be fastened um, with the tape and then tied with the twine to your gift or whatever it is you're giving. You can even use some of these tags on a handmade, handmade card as um, part of, of a card accent. But I just want to make these holiday tags ahead of time from the holidays so that I have tags in different colors for my packages. Um, I like to do this ahead of time because it gets hectic during the holidays and this just adds an extra touch. You can put the two from in information on the back side of the tags. I hope you like this quick and simple and fun technique for making handmade tags for the holidays. Thanks for watching. Take a moment to subscribe. Thank you.